All right, and welcome back to the channel, everybody. I hope you're doing fine. So there's another DLC around the corner, and that is through the Bone Briar. It contains one legendary hunter and two legendary guns. The legendary hunter is this one right here. That's Kane, and you can get one Spectre Bayonet, this one here, and the Winfield Vandal Striker. There you go. So if you missed last Halloween event where we had the Weatherly Bayonet, that's also one with a lot of bones. The Spectre Bayonet is a similar style, so maybe you want to grab that one. Pretty interesting hunter, I have to say. Definitely something unusual. I like that he basically carries the whole server on his back. That's that's pretty amazing. So really liking this one. This video is a little bit longer because I play his weapons and I'm not used to them most of the time. And I'm gonna play also Dragon Breath. It's been a while. And I'm gonna play everything solo. And Dragon Breath solo is probably not the best purpose for that ammo, but we will see. I will also talk about Dragon Breath in this video a little bit, because I still think it's weak. So, first clip is also the longest one, because, well, it's actually a, a lie. The first clip is very short, because I just want to show uh, the new minor grunt a little bit more. And then afterwards, we'll have the longest clip of the video, because there will also be a little bit of a bounty chase. And then afterwards, we will talk a little bit about Dragon Breath, because we'll exactly see what it's lacking. All right, let's get this started. Come here. That idiot. <laughs> oh shit, that's brutal, dude. I think she vaulted back in. Now it's still outside. Sneaky. She jumped out? Yeah, I heard that, but I didn't hear the drop, so... How come the bounty carriers were not shooting at her then? See? Wh what? She was there. I don't know exactly where or hiding here. 
That's where she was. Thieves? Oh, they're playing their game, that's okay. But see, did, did you see that? The Dragon Breath at the window? She was in the window, I shot the fucking window with Dragon Breath, and she had enough time to sidestep the pellets. I don't get it. The, the velocity of these pellets is, is so fucking slow. And I think that's the main issue right now with the Dragon Breath. Okay, next. And then you have long ammo, and long ammo is just fucking good. Wait, that's not a bounty carrier though. Here, woods here, like that area, maybe even in that barn. <laughs> they all, they all look through the crack in the door. Just shoot the fucking door. <laughs> that was fast. Thanks, guys. Dude, why... Why would you just face the boss building like this? You shoot me so fucking fast, so you're at least good at aiming. But then you do this? Like there! Motherfucker crazy.
Necromancer. Should not be alive. It's okay. Nice, nice, nice. That was well played. Oh! Wait, you can. <coughs> oh! I have to wait. The Mosin otherwise one taps me. Why can you not? <gasps> His teammate might be dead, dead. I think he's running. Yup. Come back here. Uh, come back here. The teammate is dead, dead. Lantern's inside. I think he's dead. Yep. I see him. I'm not done with you. I I'm not done with you. You come the fuck back here. He does realize he cannot extract, right? <laughs> My god, guys. Seconds. There he is.
Come on, this is your moment. Oh my god, fucking dragon breath. I wanted that. I wanted the style points. I wanted the style points on top. They're mine. Oh <laughs> fucking hell. Right. Okay. I could loot this dude for some cash. But uh, I have no consumables and no tools, so I will get nothing. So we just extract. Okay, I got greedy there at the end. I have to admit that. I really wanted the Dragon Breath kill. So, first of all, Dragon Breath cannot one-hit kill. It still can't. Flesh Hat can it now, so that's nice. Only for Headshot though. I don't know. The problem is with Dragon Breath, you really have to restrain yourself to a certain playstyle. You need to hit people with Dragon Breath, and the moment they hit, you have to switch to Long Ammo and finish them off. That's it. That's how you play it. You light them on fire, and if you don't play it with long ammo, take cover, let them burn, repeat. It's actually very rare at like, you know, longer distances, and longer distances is like 10 meters plus to two tap people with Dragon Breath. And on top of that, the pellets fly painfully slow. Like we're talking here, I think it's 100 meters per second. 100. I think even Derringer has faster bullets. On top of that, Flechette, for example, has 400 meters per second, roughly, I think. So, the main issue is that at 10 meters, 50 meters, and you shoot them with Dragon Breath, they can't just fucking sidestep that. It's mostly coincidence when they do it, but still, it's, it's wild, okay? So, Dragon Breath, in my opinion right now, I don't want to buff it in damage, and I don't want to buff it in, you know, the burning it's doing, but maybe give it a little bit faster pellets. That could be one try. And then also a good tip for Hunt Children in general is you should always check your spawns. Is there a range shotgun combination where you're able to fire enough Dragon Breath rounds before the first? Let me see. No way you... She's bleeding. What the fuck? Come back now and finish the job! Tom, I think that's enough hunt for the day. Yeah, <laughs> I agree. Ow. Not deserved. What do you mean not deserved? It's psychotic. not my fault that they die to fucking dogs. Okay, so first team that, then there was a banish at wolf set, so I checked that out. Keep in mind, you cannot one shot kill people. I have no idea what the dudes in the boss lane have for ammo, so I'm a little bit worried because if I run into a shotgun, I cannot trade. So maybe I burn a bar, but I will still die. So let's see. 
what we will find in the enemy boss lane. Oh shit, it's even downstairs. I hope they grab it, because it would tell me they're both inside and there's not one sitting over there. Are you? My wooden serpent be good here. Can somebody else please show up and push them? I'm just a sad solo. Why do I have to do this? Knock, knock. Mad lad played Dragon Breath. Another Dragon Breath. In the wild. What is this? And that's the reason why the Spectre Bayonet is pretty good. It's scanty. I can't read that. I need to wait until this uh, crispy bar is gone. So it was a solo then? If you hadn't Dragon Breath, you wouldn't have needed the Bayonet. Yes, but with Dragon Breath, th that's what I want to say. With Dragon Breath, you can play the Spectre Bayonet. Exactly for that reason. No, Nino doesn't play on Europe, so it's, it's definitely not him. There are two teams. There's one team south and one is northeast. There are panks. Except the bounty. For a second I thought the Springfields hit me because I was bleeding at the same time. Why do you do this? Okay, let's see. Two here, two there. Oh, that's great. Uh, I will try to fuck off and if they chase me I fight them here. There he is, underneath the cart. <sighs> Our caveman is running away with his bounty! 
Now, one thing might happen. Only one team follows me. I have to fight those. While the other team is picking up the bounty, it's coming a few seconds later and I have to fight them too. Best pistol, uppercut. And then officer. Come on, baby, I'm speed! Fuck! <laughs> oh no. I even predicted the outcome. Why don't you take the other bounty and leave me the fuck alone? What did I ever do to you? No! Fuck off. Yes. Cover me, trees. I'm one of you. I am nature. No way I can extract. Yeah, no way. That's what you get. That's what you get. No, but no. They, you know, they just, I don't understand. Wait, but why were they both low on health? They, they stressed so fast to get me that they probably got hit by AI or... So yeah, next time just take the other bounty. And let Derp Hank sleep, okay? But no, they, they had to chase me while they I got a little bit lucky there though, to be honest, because normally you do not die to uppercut body shots. I think they rushed so hard to get me that they probably got clapped by, I don't know, maybe a hive swarm or maybe an armor and slapped the booty, and then, well, long ammo is still pretty good. Now, I rented a lot about Dragon Breath. And I'm like, you know what, why, why should I play Dragon Breath? Let's just play Flechette rounds. And the crazy part is, Flechette is even cheaper. Th that's the crazy part. I think Dragon Breath costs 40 and I think Flechette costs 50. Wow. They didn't check spawn, okay. Well, let's do a meet and greet with them. If this will be better. Should have used that stamina shot.
okay. I think that's end of discussion. Okay, but Dragon Breath, Flechette, that's all nice. Let's go back to standard ammo and let's go to push some boss layer. And I have to say, it's always scary when you push people and you know they have shotguns. So, I heard one winning with levering. Why were there steps behind me just now? What the fuck? Oh yeah, sure. We're fucking sluts! Nice. They both have fucking sluts in their rivals. Nice. Can you maybe stop with these fucking star talks, dude? Uh, it's super annoying. Do I charge him? Ah, he will block me anyway. I think I have to. What hunt are you playing? Uh, the new DLC, the cane. You know, the Crytek partners always get a little bit more, you know, early. Are slugs better in every way over buck? Uh, 99% of the time, yes. I would not hip fire the slugs though. The sands look awesome, dark side boost. Oh, yes. They do. Okay, let's go out north northwest. I lost all my consumables, so that's kind of shitty. Mm. 
Is an arm shot close distance? Uh, no, it's no kill. Need a torso. What's your KDA? Oh, dude. What's your problem, dude? I don't know my KDA. I checked it last time, 2018. Thanks, dude. Some people just don't fucking get it. <laughs> now you're probably wondering, who's Mike talking to there? So, I died a lot this evening. Well, I always die a lot, to be completely honest with you. I'm not showing it in this video, <laughs> because this is YouTube and I have to look good, okay? People kill me, they come into the chat and they're like, Oh man, I killed you, awesome dude. And normally I say, yeah, okay, GG, it's fine. But then they start the bragging, you know? And they're like, oh, I even... Oh, I didn't know that. I'm above your elo level. Oh, I thought you would be way better. You know, this is, this is always the stuff you want to hear, you know? And then you ask them, hey man, m maybe you want to stop the, the stars discussion. It, it's getting kind of boring, you know? I have this every fucking stream. And they're like... Oh yeah, okay, okay, okay. What's your KD? Motherfucker. How dense are you? <laughs> like, come on. Then, of course, the mods, you know, they protect me. I have awesome mods, so thank you guys. They gave him a little slap on the wrist, you know, five minutes timeout. That's not even that much. But boy, dude, this guy had some serious pride issues. After the five minutes... This one, <laughs> and then, and this is this is in my opinion the the most fascinating one. You know, normally, you, okay, you know what? But I should not have pissed off the streamer. He asked me to to not talk about this anymore. I still did it. Then the mods typed me out for like only five minutes. Then I insulted the mods. It's just there's there's just so much smooth brain activity. You can do some ice skating on this dude's brain. Seriously. And then you have to wait actually 15 minutes to have your unban appeal. You can't immediately do that. So this dude stored this message here in his copy paste for 15 minutes. I don't even want to get unbanned. You guys are terrible. I just asked two totally normal questions. I asked about KDA WTF. How dare I to ask a stupid normal question? Have fun playing a digging game with a shitty content creator. BB Idiots. Unfollowed arrogant brick with shitty mods. I just asked two totally normal questions. And then it was over to, yeah, yeah. First he comes in, brags that he kills me. Tries to save it. As the moment he ma he realizes that his, his fucking bragging doesn't make any friends. <laughs> oh, this will suck. To push that guy, I think. Another mind breaks and joins the psychotic host. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay. Ah, <clears throat> oh, motherfucker. Okay. Well, I guess I need to look for a med kit. Are there more than one? No, he rotated. But I need some goodies. Also, what the fuck is going on with the other bounty? He's hitting his shots, so that's pretty, pretty nice. For him, at least. <laughs> oh 
Boah, nee. <lacht> oh mein Gott, dude, no. Well, they were ui. So yeah, enough of that though. I censored his name because I don't want people to send any hate over to him. Maybe he just had a bad day. We all have these. So all good, whatever. I just wanted to show you a little bit what we have to deal during the streams on, I think, a daily basis even. So there is that. Now, that Sparks was blocking the extraction quite successfully and I was like, you know what? Fuck that shit. My Windy Vandal Striker against this probably Sparks Sniper. I'm not doing that. So, the little coward that I am, Caveman goes running very, very fast. I'm running a few extra steps because I don't want to... Oh my god. So if he's still behind me or next to me, this might suck. Because <laughs> this is slightly open here and I don't like this. Let's see. Yo, thanks for all the cover against long ammo, bro. Every now and then people ask me, shouldn't legendary hunters come with special perks or special abilities? And I always say no, because that would be paid to win. But this clip right here always, you know, it would still be awesome, maybe for a weekend or event or something, if you would get like special abilities. And I think that uh, Derp Hanks, Kane, should maybe get the ability to communicate with the wildlife and team up with it. That actually... Wait a second. <laughs> no. You have to deal with the doggy. Doggy, 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 doggy. <laughs> Let's charge him! To battle my dogs! Let's stress him a little bit. Wait. Wait, how did that not hit at all? <laughs> wow, dude, he didn't give a shit about the decoy. Fucking legend. Like an absolute beast. He was like, no. That's fake. Uh, I, 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 I'm not buying that. Uh, I think he got hit by the dog quite a bit, that's why he was a one tap. Ah oh, shit dude, I was very ambitious there with my Romero hatchet though. Aw oh, guys, I'm so sorry. He was still blinded. Blinded by the line. Yes, my battle dogs. Very effective. Can highly recommend them. <laughs> of course I was just joking. Okay, this should, this should not be a thing. <clears throat> now, as you can see, AI can be pretty helpful in PvP combat, especially when the other team is unlucky and not you. But AI in general is a little bit hard and something s happens and then sometimes things spiral out of control. Yeah, dude, they do side straight. Hello. Naked man. 5,000 hours. Are you fucking what? Yeah, that bar is gone. Uh. Ow. Yeah. 
Oh, I have to run! Damn it, get it! Oh, I'm safe. Oh. <laughs> oh, this game is so easy. It's frightening how good I am at it. Okay, that that was an unfortunate turn of events. Okay, that was not cool, guys. That was not cool! I'm gonna die to him now. What the fuck? Hey, come back now! I'm cooking this! Alright, okay. That was a good one. Whew. AI is hard. Okay. <laughs> Dude, that was such a shitty timing on everything. Everything that was just shitty right now. Oh, that's fucking cold. Yes, I, I would definitely take a banish or two. No. Yeah, I guess I'm not mailing him anymore. Ah, dude. Easiest game of my life. <laughs> oh, shit, son. Oi, oi, oi. Don't play games with me now. Fucking die! Now don't get too close, don't get slapped now. Hi, right, easy. <laughs> oh my god. So anyway, I started surviving. <laughs> Dude, when I stepped outside and the fucking leech bit me in the ass, man. And poisoned me. I'm like, dude, you, you cannot make this shit up. It's impossible. Where's the other one? Okay. <laughs> you can't make this shit up. I had to stop the burning, but I had to run because I was poisoned. And the meat it was like, mmm, juicy caveman. Motherfuckers. So yeah. Easy. Easiest butcher fight of my, of my entire life. So I killed him. There were shots at fort. I was going to check that out, so... I leave the bounty behind so they don't see me coming and then we sneak up on them like the creepy caveman that we are. We'll be like, wait, what the fuck? What is this naked man doing here? Wait, you can't go up there? Oh, what a shame. Okay, okay, you're running? All right, all right, fine. 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 Fucking fine. Wait. <laughs> Where was it actually? The next one, right? The next one. There was another team and the team will probably shoot me now while I loot, but hey. 
I need some stuff. The naked man needs some stuff. Thank you, dude. Much appreciated. Fucker. <laughs> Oi, why are you doing this? Oh, I was actually close to a kill. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, it's another booger man. Is that another booger man? So yeah, these two dudes, they were fighting, I think it's solo the whole time. He wasn't peeking the window anymore. I didn't want to push there. I killed a couple people. I killed Bounty. There is The other Bounty is gone. There's nothing there to win for me. So I decided, you know what? Okay, there are two tokens. You take one. I take one. Let's see. The Dragon Breath part. The Dragon Breath part was good and bad at the same time because it just showed... Uh, it still needs a buff. It still needs a buff, dude. And it was so painfully obvious. Like, I switched from Dragon Breath to Flechette, and this, this is not the same, dude. Like, from the difficulty, it, it's a fucking joke. Flechette, Slugs, even regular Buckshot, dude. Everything is so fucking easy compared to... ...to Dragon Breath. And that's it for today's video. Again, pretty long, but Dragon Breath matches are never short. I if you don't die immediately. Dragon Breath seems to be the ammo full of spite. If I can't win, I'm gonna make sure you won't win either. And would you have a look at this wall? Because there's so many amazing patrons out there. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you for watching. More stuff is coming very soon. I even have another full Hunter Life coming up. I see you in the next one. Until then, have a good day and bye-bye.